someone sent a Christian to me talking about if the global reset kicks us out into the wilderness. Okay. Oh, I got a banjo. We'll be kicked out of society one day. That's right. First century John the Baptist. What's going on, y'all? Figured I'd come out to the old saloon. Wow, I think he has a little bit of like a. Uh, 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 Go. A per, I'm, I'm a hero thing going on. Uh, you haven't ruined his life. You're giving him reason to live. Without you, Dave has nothing to rage against, and therefore no reason to wake up. I think it's why he's so obsessed with you. Oh, maybe. <clears throat> Buckshot Ridge today i hadn't been out here in a couple weeks it's just peaceful i can think out here um performative redneck i love it look there's so many people that are so reluctant to sponsor conservative channels like mine so i'm very thankful for mine i want to mention birch gold look wow birch china's been stockpiling gold for six straight months y'all know wow four minute video and right now we're into an ad already hmm doing okay buddy doing okay hmm not a grift at all this They've been stockpiling it. What are they seeing and preparing for that we don't know about? Stockpiling gold? Preparing for that we don't know about. Okay. Let's say the apocalypse happens and China has all the gold. They have lots of gold. What does that mean? What are they... Why does that matter? Huh? Who cares? They have gold now. I don't... I don't understand. <laughs> all these new currencies forming, and they're all backed by gold. Not our dollar. We're not the world standard anymore. So go to birchgold.com slash buddy. Oh, yeah, because capitalism. Capitalism is the thing. You know how how gold is worth something? They're backed by gold. I don't know that gold that exists is like, yeah, I endorse that dollar bill. Or text buddy to 989898. Get your free info kit on gold and protect your hard-earned money from this crap inflation Biden's throwing on us. Biden's throwing on us. Hmm. A Christian, you say? I wonder if it has anything to do with the, co the co collaborative brain rot of conservatism. No, there's probably no overlap whatsoever between being religious and being fucking stupid. Nope. So I wanted to let y'all in on a little thought this morning. We're about 16 months out from the next election. Y'all realize that? Can you believe how fast it went just like that? This next election will be different than anything we've ever had. Oh, will it? Uh. In the USA history. Even worse than the 2020 thing. Here's why. By the 2024 election, we will have nearly perfect deep fake and AI generated videos which could pretty much submit to the public some of the most horrible and unimaginable things that are spoken and done by presidential candidates. I'm not worried about deep fakes. I don't care. I don't give a shit. <laughs> so what we're doing here is we're already being like, I mean, Trump didn't do it. And if it's DeSantis, he didn't do it either. Like, <laughs> like what? And with the news trust level at an all time low, because nobody trusts them. Nobody not, trusts them. That's right. Going to be able to distinguish. This guy sounds smart. I should listen to him for my advice. I hope you really have a contact. Ghost dad. An anonymous gifter. Thanksgiving with a dude. Ledoo. Thank you so much. Someday, someday I'll find out who you are. Real from fake. Some people are going to want to believe so badly that they're willing to listen to anything, no matter how ridiculous it sounds. And it just reminds me of that itching ears verse in the Bible where it says that it will come a time when there's so much deception that people will believe whatever their itching ears are willing to hear. You just sold a gold scam 40 seconds ago. You were selling, you were doing a gold scam. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> are wanting to hear, and we're there, y'all. Yeah. You've seen the proof in the pudding. That's right, and each one of you is one of mine. 
So listen up, I got a second sponsor, my Patreon. <laughs> You know, whether you're a Democrat or Republican, though, I do think Betty's you should merch. be very excited that Trump is running. Woo! Betty's got merch. What would I, what I say? Here's why. Mm -hmm. Because both Trump and Hillary at some different points have said that everything is rigged. But if he's running again, he doesn't really believe that. No way. Because he wouldn't waste his time. Something terrible is coming. Is your shirt fucking ripped, bud? Why would you show us this angle? What is going on here? Social media has already hit us with alternative news. What? Did he not know? Amazing. And alternative facts. And we're going to go over the edge in probably just two or three years. Wow. We're going to go over the edge in two or three years. That's right. Um, I fucking hope all the Republicans run away into the woods and die of cholera. Personally. But as far as this deep fake stuff Go. goes, if you've ever worked for the gold sponsorship, didn't pay as much as he thought it would. The railroad. You've heard Why does he want money if he knows that this is going to happen? Heard the term. This is the end of the line. That doesn't mean there's a delay. That don't mean that this is just another stop. It means there's no more tracks. I remember growing up. Start when the it was, music right back over. It's just really cool to be smart, right? You know, it was just good to know things, and it was even better to learn. Yeah, this guy's real smart. It's cool to be smart, like Buddy Brown. <clears throat> it's a ventilation thing. It's actually real. It's not fucked up. Oh, okay. Now we're being told that learning is just pointless because the next generation was going to have sure it's supposed to be like that. Have to go up okay. against AI that is 10,000 times smarter than a human being, 10,000 times quicker. And how are we going to compete? It'd be like sending your six year old into the ring to fight Mike Tyson back in 1995 or sending your little league all-star team in there to play the Atlanta Braves. My question is, what happens when no people from any country trust their government anymore? Or even trust their own reality anymore? When everyone is convinced that something sinister is now their god and they can't fight it. There's a verse in Revelation 13 about the beast rising out of the sea with ten horns and seven heads, ten diadems with evil and blasphemous names written on it. Look, people are going to cry out, who is like the beast? Who can fight against it? Quicker, yes. Smarter, eh. I don't know what the beast contains, if it's just an unstoppable AI, if it's just an unstoppable power, but it's creepy. It's going to freak everybody out, and everyone is going to want to surrender and turn away from God. Everyone, that's when people turn away from God. But I have turned towards God. So please, also turn towards God, and also turn yourself towards my 3150 American Savage merge. I got the uh, star spangled on the right shoulder and the uh, stripes red and white on the left. You got it. And you can get the Arrowhead logo right on there because I've co-opted Arrowhead logos and put it on my stuff. That's absolutely right. That's why I got this uh, uh, this beautiful portrait in the background. I got this here, uh, Arrowhead. That's right. There's going to become a day when everyone is uh, basically going to have to accept the global reset. Uh, we have some readability problems with your text, uh, but I do love I love the inspiration of this. Um, specifically, I love this big butter right here. <laughs> Clocks too. Butter luck next time. <laughs> I think that will be the title. <laughs> we'll have we'll have Sarah do her magic on that. Set, and they're gonna be kicked out into the wilderness. And I guess what? I'm gonna be right there with you. Yeah. Looking like John the Baptist, pointing you to the real truth, which is Christ. Yeah, he self-appointed himself the new John the Baptist, wouldn't you know it? Not not just any character in the Bible. John the Baptist was a redneck, y'all. You know that? You know, he wasn't a fan of fashion. He lived in the woods. He ate locusts and honey. Please go eat some fucking bugs. Prove it. And uh, I'm going to try to carry on that legacy and point people to him. And that's pretty much my job here. You know, I thought I started this channel for music, but God had something a whole lot bigger in store for me. Appreciate you so much for tuning in. Be good. Everything's gay in June. Isn't that pretty cool? Yeah, I'm not going to watch any of his music stuff. Uh, we have in the past. It's bad. Uh, so there, I guess that there's that guy. That's the most recent video. That was four days ago. It's the most recent non-singing video he's done. Buddy Brown. Uh, if you're religious, you're a fucking wacko to me. You don't make any goddamn sense.